What do you think is a good number of games he played? 82 games, man. This is what the fucking job calls for. You're not practicing. You're not even playing a whole fucking... You don't play in the summer? Right. I can see if you playing in the summer, you on the playground, you went to the Olympics, then it's training camp, y'all do 30 days of uh, fucking tour days. Okay, that's when you get rest. Man, I don't want to hear this shit, man. I don't want to hear none of this shit. Motherfucker can sit out a back-to-backs? Bro, don't... Bro, hey, listen, we done with that comparison of the era shit. We're going to respect this era and what it does, and, and that's it. I don't, want, don't, don't, don't compare nobody and none of this shit because I think, you can't. If you ain't played, man, man, listen. I think that's going to hurt Philly. That's going to hurt Philly from a, not even that, but bro. From you, a seeding perspective. Nah, like, it's, it's, you know it's, it's random. One night I got P, next P, night, next night I ain't got it. You might have to put, they might put themselves in the position to where they play Boston in the first round. Bro, it all over the place, real shit. And ain't nobody, ain't nobody saying nothing. You know what I'm saying? Ain't nobody holding nobody accountable, bro. So, so not only are they not going to practice, they're not, they going to sit out. <laughs> I ain't got you in 15. <laughs> I look back up. to back. It's tough, but what Kevin Garnett is saying here is true. Joel Embiid has made a decision to sit out of back-to-back -back games the rest of his career. The decision makes no sense because that doesn't guarantee that you're not getting hurt. It's sad that a lot of the stars of today sit out constantly and don't show up for work, like Kawhi Leonard, Joel Embiid, Ben Simmons, and many more. The NBA has made a 65-game rule to be eligible for NBA awards, and it's looking like the players don't really care, as if they did they would have played more games. Let me know what you think in the comments.